What up, motherfuckers? Tony China Deeds here. Big decision. No more censoring shit. If I feel like I want to say it, I'm gonna fucking say it from now on. I actually am fucking sick right now. I don't care that I have a halls inside my mouth. And I actually just woke up, had an epiphany, and just decided, hey, I'm gonna record something for YouTube. And I don't care that my hair is fucked up right there because I fell asleep and the freaking pillow messed up my hair and I'm too fucking lazy to go comb it. I think I own a comb. So I'm actually gonna be doing my videos a little bit different now, as you can see, a lot faster. There's almost pretty much no pauses whatsoever now. Um, that's the way it's gonna be. I can fit more stuff into tiny little space, just like your freaking brain. And also, if you're wondering what this thing right here is, this is one of my new backdrops. Not really, it's actually just a poster that I bought. Shut up, Xbox. Xbox, shut up. I got the Kinect for Xbox and sometimes it does things it's not supposed to. But anyways, this poster right here is actually a painting that I bought off of eBay. It was supposed to be from a famous painter, um, an original painting, and then when I fucking got it from China, those fucking Chinese people. You can clearly see it's a print on a piece of shit paper. It's not even real whatsoever. So this is my reminder that Asians will try to steal your money at every single chance that they can get. And they will order hot water in a restaurant every chance that they get. Please, please. This is a public announcement. Stop fucking posting all your shit on Facebook, okay? Because I'm fucking tired of it. You're talking about how much your life sucks. Well, guess what? My life sucks a little bit more because I gotta fucking read your fucking problems and find out how you freaking got crabs because on Friday you went out and somehow did some freaking guy that did things that did things that uncle's sister's dog sat on your face, okay? I don't fucking care. I don't care to read that shit. In fact, I wish I could take a gun and shoot you in the fucking head. And because of all your excessive, excessive status updates about all your problems and all your issues and how the world hates you, the world and everybody in the freaking universe, the universe's IQ is actually lower because they're reading shit that you're posting up on your social networks. I'm fucking serious. E.T. somewhere out there in some distant planet is like, I'm fucking dumber now. I'm also tired of seeing all these ugly fat women posting all these pictures like they're half naked. Like, fucking stop it, okay? I don't know if anybody or nobody has told you that you're ugly and you're fat and you shouldn't be wearing those freaking clothes, but I don't want to sign on to Facebook. Facebook and feel like I have to gouge my eyes out because I seen 12 pictures that just suddenly popped up of your ass flopping out your ass through your breasts. And to the all semi cute ladies that think they're fucking models, I just want to let you know that you're actually not a fucking model. I dub you as a public hoochie. What you do behind closed doors, that kind of shit that you would wear, those kind of things that you would do for your man, all you're doing is taking pictures and posting them up on private shit that should be like that. You're not no fucking model, I tell you that. If at any point in time you're wondering, hey, am I too fat to be taking these pictures in this little G-string bikini? Or if you're at any time you're like, hey, as a model, should I be taking pictures like this? I just want you to question yourself this one question. What would Jesus do? Smite you is what Jesus would fucking do. Here's, here's something that was really pissing me off. Uh, Casey fucking Anthony. If anybody knows him, they've seen my video before that's on my freaking channel. She uh, is known because she killed her daughter and got away with it and freaking got out of jail free. Well, anyways, not only did she get out of jail for killing her daughter, they are now offering her, and this is just an offer, they plan for it to go even higher, $8 million for a book deal. They expect it to go as high as $15 million. That's not even the movie deal that they're trying to work out. So, let's just say she gets paid $15 million and screw the freaking movie, right? $15 million. This, this fucking bitch got paid $15 million to kill her fucking daughter and fucking get away with it. So here's what I'm going to do. Any freaking company that's going to back Casey Anthony and make a movie or make a fucking book, not only will I not buy that piece of shit crap, I will boycott the freaking company and you should fucking too. I don't care if Coca-Cola fucking backs her up. I will never fucking drink a Coca-Cola. In fact, next time, if I fucking see a polar bear, I'm going to fucking kick it in his fucking head.